And we're coming to you live with some breaking news. This term's literacy unit is all about examining media texts. What are media texts and why is everyone talking about them? Media construct our society and culture. A few generations ago, our culture's storytellers were people, family, friends and others in the community. For many people today, the most powerful storytellers are televisions, movies, music, video games and the internet. Media literacy skills. These refer to the ability to access, analyse, evaluate and create media messages of all kinds. Who would need these skills? Why is it important to comprehend media text in today's world? Being well educated in media literacy gives youth and adults necessary skills to decipher the complicated messages that we receive from all different types of media sources. Can media texts influence us to think a particular way? All media messages try to persuade us to believe or do something. News, documentary films and non-fiction books all claim to be telling the truth. Advertising tries to get us to buy products. Novels and TV dramas go to great lengths to appear realistic. To do this, they use specific techniques that we call the language of persuasion. Media messages affect our thoughts, attitudes and actions. We don't like to admit it, but all of us are affected by advertising, news, movies, pop music, video games and other forms of media. Media constructs fantasy worlds. While fantasy can be very entertaining, it can also be harmful. Movies, TV shows and music videos sometimes inspire people to do things that are unwise, antisocial or even dangerous. At other times, media can inspire our imagination. Advertising constructs a fantasy world where all problems can be solved with a purchase. Media literacy helps people to recognise fantasy and constructively integrate it with reality. No one tells the whole story. Every media maker has a point of view. Every good story highlights some information and leaves the rest out. Often the effect of media messages comes not only from what is said, but from what part of the story is not told. The values and viewpoints influence the choice of words, sounds and images that are communicated through media. Media often contains text and subtext. The text is the actual words, pictures and sounds in the media message. The subtext is the hidden and underlying meaning of the message. We need to be able to navigate this complex media environment to make sense of media messages that bombard us every day. But it's also really important that we are able to express ourselves using a variety of media tools and technologies.